So I am making shahi anda today. Name of the dish is given by my husband. He calls it shahi anda because it is rich in flavors, rich in nutrition and rich in colors. So this is not something very common you will see people preparing at their home. So I'm giving you a new experiment to do in your kitchens. So my husband loves it, my in-laws love it and I don't eat egg and I don't eat meat but I prepared everything. So I'll quickly show you the ingredients followed by the recipe for shahi anda. 7 boiled eggs, 3 onions, 2 bell peppers, 1 red and 1 green, 1 tomato, some curd, some turmeric powder, coriander powder, curry leaves, jeera which are cumin seeds and this is rye or mustard seeds, red chilli powder, garlic, cloves, salt. I'm using this pasta sauce which is Cucina Chunky Mushroom Pasta Sauce but you can use any tomato sauce or pasta sauce or pasetta of your choice. finely chopped one tomato, two onions finely chopped and have diced big pieces of green capsicum, red capsicum and onion. I have taken a frying pan, I will add two tablespoons of oil. I forgot to turn on the gas. We'll let the oil heat. We'll add cumin seeds, rye, to this. Cumin seeds and mustard seeds have started spluttering. We'll add the onions now. We'll sort it in. We'll add garlic to this. We'll sort it again. Onion is translucent in color. We'll add dhania powder, turmeric powder, red chili powder and salt. We'll quickly add the chopped tomato. We'll add some water. We'll add eggs to this now. We'll saute this. We'll add onions, red peppers and green peppers to this. So Shahi Anda is ready, we'll serve it for you now.
Shahi Anda is ready. Serve this dish to your family and friends and share your reviews with me. Subscribe to my channel if you already